Today, we're guessing Pokemon only using emojis. They're gonna start out pretty easy, but by the end, they are going to be practically impossible. If I get it right, I get to add the Pokemon to my team. You guys know the drill. Play along with me and comment down below your answers. And if you get at least one right, leave a like on today's video. Level easy. This is the first one. On the left side, there is yellow, and on the right side, it is a mouse. There's only one Pokemon that this could possibly be. If you guys know it, comment it down below. But I am going to lock in Pikachu. Please tell me it's right. Yes, we got the first one. That means I can add Pikachu to my Pokemon team. Ash Ketchum would be proud. Next up, there is an E plus a V. I wonder what this could be. I don't want to overthink the easy round too much. So I think I'm going to lock in the Pokemon Eevee. If it's not, I'm going to throw my chair out my window. Yes, okay, cool. We got it. Up next. Next, we have a dragon plus nighttime, I think, or moon and stars and a cloud, but that's pretty much just like a nighttime scene. So I think this one is probably going to be the Pokemon Dragonite. Let's see. Yes, two, three for three. We're off to a hot start. Next up, we have a, a cannon on the left side and a turtle on the right side. And I think there's only one Pokemon I know that's a turtle that has cannons on the shoulder. And that is the full evolution of Squirtle, Blastoise. Please. Yes, dude, we got it. Let's go, dude. Four for four. Next up, we have Meow and the number two. Um, who could that be? Wait a second. If we take the O out of Meow, isn't it just Mewtwo? I'm not sure if that's right, but that is the only Pokemon that ends in the number two. So we're going to go with Mewtwo. Oh my God. Yes, bro. Easy mode is too easy. I mean, it makes sense. Moving along, we have a frog on the left side and a head of cabbage on the right side. Frog and cabbage? Um, wait, hold on. Isn't there like a frog type Pokemon that has like a lily pad around its neck? It's not Electrike. It's, um, is it Lotad, right? I think that might be the one that I'm thinking about. Or maybe Ludicolo is it the other one that maybe kind of makes a little bit of sense. What are the other frog type Pokemon? I mean, there's obviously Froakie, there's Greninja, there's Poliwag and Poliwhirl which are kind of frog-like. And there's also Politoed. Now that I'm thinking about it, I honestly think that it might be Politoed. So we're gonna lock that in. We're gonna lock in Politoed. Bulbasaur. Bulbasaur is not a frog. Bulbasaur is a dinosaur. Are you kidding me, dude? If anything, Bulbasaur like is not a frog. Bulbasaur looks nothing like a frog. Gosh dang it. I can't believe I missed that one. All right, we're going to move on. We're not going to focus on the losses. All right, next one. There's a water squirt on the left side. And then on the right side, there's a turtle. This has to be Squirtle, right? It's literally a turtle plus squirt, which is Squirtle. Yes. All right, cool. We're back on track, ladies and gentlemen. Too easy. What is this next one? It's got to be Jigglypuff? That's like one of the only Pokemon that has really big, cute looking eyes and it's a big blob kind of like Kirby. I think that's it. That's like the only one that I can really think of. I guess maybe Clefairy could be another one. It's either Clefairy or Jigglypuff, but I gotta go with my gut here. Now I'm going with Jigglypuff. Jigglypuff it is! I am smashing it today. Okay, this next one honestly just looks like a sea serpent, which, okay, it could be a few different Pokemon, right? Yeah, there's there's Superior, there's Dragonair, which honestly, I feel like it might be. Um, it could be Milotic, I guess. But Milotic has a different color scheme, so it's probably not that. And I mean, the one that it looks like the most that I haven't said yet is the one that I think it is. And I think I'm going to lock it in. I'm going to go with Gyarados. Yes, bro! I'm killing it right now! Uh, this next one is a duck with question marks. Um, uh, it's not far-fetched. No, there's no way it's far-fetched. What's the duck? Crap. What, uh, what's, it's, uh, Psyduck, right? Psyduck? Yes, 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 dude! Yes, let's go! Oh, we're on to level medium. Okay, what is this? Um, okay, I think it's, is that dragon type with bat wings? Is it Noivern? Is that, maybe? I don't know. I, I honestly, genuinely, I'm, I'm so confused right now. I, is that dragon type? You guys are gonna roast me if that's not, but I think it's dragon type on the left side. And then on the right side, yeah, with the giant wings, I'm gonna go Noivern. Oh, it's Salamence. All right, well, I, I guess it kind of does make a little bit of sense. 
I was at least kind of close, I guess. All right, next up, we're not gonna worry about that last one. We have a man that is flexing. Totally not Alec. And on the bottom, uh, we have a six pack of abs. So we have abs plus uh, the movie Soul, right? Absol. Is that it? Is that, wait, yeah, no, Absol. That's a Pokemon. Absol. 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 <laughs> okay, next up, Zoe Rourke. Okay. All right, well, this one should have been a level easy. This is Zorork, obviously. Yeah, we got Got it. Okay, let's see. Uh, next up, we have Axo tie. Axo tie. Like like an axolotl. Axo tie. Axo tie. Axo tie. What Pokemon could this possibly be? Ax. What, well, okay, so what ends in O tie? That is a tie on the right side, right? What else could that be? I mean, it is pointing to the cloud, or yeah, right. It's pointing to the cloud. So maybe it's a like a like a Axo cloud. I mean, the only Pokemon that I can possibly think of is either Axu, right? Or Fracture or whatever, like the pre-evolutions of Haxorus. Cause I feel like like Fracture has Axe in the actual name. So I'm gonna go with that and let's see if that's it. It was Haxorus, the Pokemon that I was just talking about, who I didn't think that it was, but it turns out it actually was Haxorus. Yeah. Moving along, we have a fly plus gone, but it's a gone fishing. The gone is the one thing that's actually circled out. So this one, yeah, this one's actually kind of easy. Uh, like it can only be one thing and I'm thinking it's fly gone. Yes, dude, let's go. That's awesome. We're killing it right now. Okay, this one is a rhino plus um a knight. Rhino night rock. <laughs> I am missing something right now. A uh, dino, like a dinosaur. Dinosaur night rock. D dino night boulder. Um, Rhino Rhyperior, maybe, right? Uh, Rhydon, could could be Rhydon, or yeah, Rhyperior. I wanna go with Rhyperior here. Rhyperior is kind of the only Pokemon that kind of looks like a Triceratops, and the rest of it maybe makes sense. I don't know, we'll figure it out. Agra, no, dude, I guess, kinda. It, yeah, okay, that one does make sense after you see it. Dang it, dude. Okay, next up, we have a turtle plus the sea plus ice, turtle sea ice. So what Pokemon is in the water, but it's also an ice type. So maybe it's a water type and an ice type that's a turtle. Yeah, the only Pokemon that's coming to mind has to be Lapras, right? Lapras is a water type. I think it can learn ice moves as well. So it's Lapras. I mean, it could be Suicune, like maybe. I guess another stretch could be Avalug. That thing is giant, but it doesn't really look like a turtle, but it kind of does have like turtle-ish features. So I don't know. This one, I think it's clearly Lapras. Let's check it out. Yes, it is. Let's go. Oh, we're smashing it, ladies and gentlemen. We're not even on impossible mode yet. That does kind of worry me. Okay, this one is Typlosion, right? Right off the bat, just that, that's my gut feeling. This is Typlosion. Yes, dude. This one is a sheep that has uh, electricity abilities. Oh, what's its name? Is it, um, uh, Shamip, Sh Sh Mareep. Mareep, it's Mareep. It's gotta be Mareep. Oh. Ampharos. You know what? I feel like Mareep is a better answer because Mareep is the Pokemon that looks like a sheep. And I mean, Ampharos is technically a sheep. It's like the evolved version of Mareep. But Mareep looks a lot more like a sheep than Ampharos does. Let me know what you guys think in the comments. Okay, this one is uh, S Lemon on. S Lemon on. S is, um, what? Okay, first off, why is a poop emoji holding hands with a lemon emoji? Oh, wait, is it P? S oh, S Peon. It's P. It's it's pee and poop. It's not a lemon. It is not a lemon, ladies and gentlemen. That is pee. Okay, so this is Espeon, right? Because S and then P in the middle and then an on switch on the right side. Espeon. It's not S poop on. Espeon. Woohoo! Let's go! Killing it. Okay, next up, we are on to level impossible. First up, sandwich and a bird. Sandwich bird. Hoagie bird. Italian sub bird. Primo hoagie bird. Subway bird, what kind of bird are we talking about here? Wait a second. Okay, where do you go to get a sandwich like that? You go to the deli. It's a deli bird. Yeah, bro. Oh my God, I'm so smart. My brain is getting massive from this. I'm just too good. Okay, this one is heart and disc. Oh no, love disc, right? Cause you know, your heart, you love something with all your heart and there's a disc on the right side. It's gotta be love disc. Boom. These are not impossible for me. I'm too good. Okay, left side. 
Piranha that's green. I have no idea. The only Piranha Pokemon that I know is Carvana, right? I think that's the only Piranha type Pokemon that I can think of right now. I mean, there also is Sharpedo, but I don't think it's Sharpedo. So guess we're gonna go with it. Like that's the only thing that I can think of. And it's not, it is Basculin. I don't even know if I know what Basculin looks like. Okay, I'm not even worried about that one. Let's keep moving on. Next up. Okay, this one is um a girl that's crying, right? Cry fish. Crying fish. Uh uh a bee. Sting. Beast uh sting a uh, stun fisk. Could be a stun fisk, because the bee she got stung. So a stun and a fish is a stun fisk. Yes! I have no idea about this next one. Um what Pokemon looks like Maui if Maui decided to never work out a day in his life. I'm honestly at a loss for words. So I'm just gonna say this is unknown. It was sigilous. If. I don't think I would have gotten that, honestly. Okay, next one. These are just cogs. Oh, wait, 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 wait. What Pokemon is just made up of a bunch of cogs? Because you have, what is it? Like Electra, Electa, not, not Electabuzz. It's Magneton. That's the one that's made up of a bunch of different magnets. But which one is made up of a bunch of different cogs and gears? I think it might just be called Clink. Right, there's clink and then there's clang, clink, clang, clang, clink. It's either clink or clang. I, I think I'm gonna go with the evolution, which is clang. It was clink, clang. Do I get that one? I feel like I kind of accidentally said that. <laughs> you guys let me know if I should get that one. Okay, this next one has a trash can on the left side with a bunch of different trash inside of the trash can. And then it has a giant demon mouth on the right side. So what's like a Pokemon that just, isn't it like the trash Pokemon? What is the trash Pokemon? Is it just Trubbish? There's there's Trubbish, and then there's like the bigger version, right? Garbador, that just sounds like garbage in a fancy way. I'm gonna go with the smaller one. I'm gonna go with Trubbish. Yes! Oh my gosh, I thought it might have been Garbador. That's amazing that I got that. Okay, wait, this next one is kind of like the first one that we did. That was Pikachu. This one is a little bit of a different color. So honestly, it's probably Raichu, or could be Pichu, but I'm gonna go Raichu. Uh, it's... Did, Deden? I don't know if I know that Pokemon. Moving on, there's a fish that has big lips and it's a shark? Huh, fish with big lips. So I know a couple Pokemon that are like fish with big lips. Like Magikarp has some pretty big lips, but Magikarp doesn't have sharp teeth like a shark. Now there is Bruxish, which has big lips, but I, I don't know if it has sharp teeth. I honestly can't picture Bruxish very well. It, it kind of just like, I remember it has like a really weird face and it has like something coming out of the top of its head. I don't remember if it has sharp teeth, but that's the only two that I can think about. So I'm gonna go Bruxish. Oh my God, holy cow, I got it. Wow, that's amazing. Okay, this next one is so weird. It's drums and there's a, a entire map of the United States of America with an arrow pointing to PA. So it's Drumpa, which kind of just sounds like Drampa. Is it that easy? There also is Rillaboom, which I'm pretty sure is a Pokemon that is known for playing drums. But I think I'm just gonna lock in Drampa. That one seems the most obvious. Oh, no way, I got it! I am doing so well this time. Make sure you guys leave a like, comment down below how many Pokemon you got right, and click this video if you wanna see more.